Hello Diva Tribers and welcome to a brand, brand, brand new day. It's March 23rd and of course we're reading from our devotional. Of course, you know it's called God's Big Idea. And today our title is The Mountains Rose, The Valley Sank. And our scripture text comes to us from Genesis 1 and 9 which says, Then God said, Let the water under the sky be gathered together so the dry land will appear and it happened. Promise that if you are ever, if you ever, ever get a chance to see a volcano, you will do it. It's a sight worth seeing. It doesn't seem as though something like that could really happen. That mountains could really explode like that, which melted fiery rock flowing down. But it's true. Volcanoes really happen. Volcanoes happen underwater too. When the fiery lava hits the cold ocean water, it's cool, it cools quickly and turns to rock. It builds up over years and years, turning into an underwater mountain that pokes up out of the water. Then we call it an island. The Bible says that on the third day that God made land. Did volcanoes explode and form islands and mountains and canyons? Maybe. Listen to this poem about it. You covered the earth with oceans. The water was above the mountain. But at your command, the water rushed away. When you gave your orders like thunder, it hurried away. The mountains rose, the valley sank. The water went to the places you made for it. And you can find that in Psalm 104 verses 6 through 8. If you think that seeing a volcano would be exciting, imagine seeing this. And though the water was obedient, it sounds rather rowdy as it rushes to the places God made for it. It sounds as if the third day of creation started out very wild and noisy. <laughs> Beautiful. The mountains rose, the valleys sank. I can't wait to read for you for tomorrow. Have a blessed and a beautiful and a wonderful day, my Devo Drivers. Oh, 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 oh,